<laughs> Good morning, man. Yeah, I said, yeah, the rate was recording. Good morning, Maddie. How are you doing? What is up with you? Oh, you have this not happy face, don't you? Deer in the headlights look. What's wrong? I'm not sure what's wrong. How are you today? How are you today? Yeah? How are we today? Oh, we're gonna spit. We're gonna spit while on camera. You're always so bad for me on camera. Hi, Maddie. Hi. 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 Maddie, Maddie. Chloe wants up on the couch. Chloe got to use her stairs, though. Hi, Maddie. You're not going to smile anymore? Hi. You are so camera shy. You are so camera shy. If she is bouncing in her bouncer, she probably won't now that she's on camera, but she was just happy and talking to that big blue toy you see up on the right hand side there. I'm trying to do it from far back just in case she is camera shy and doesn't want to perform, but it looks like it's over now. She's still looking at it. She was all excited about it just a second ago. Hi. Hi. You hear daddy talking, don't you? Hi. What's up? Hi. <laughs> there it was. There it was. I know I'm pretty far back, but that's a big smile. She sure is a happy baby. Yes, she is. Every time I turn off the camera, she starts squealing. She knows. She knows. What a mean baby. Hi. Did mommy just come home from work? Did you miss mommy? <coughs> yeah, I missed you too. I really missed baby. <coughs> I know, I'm so happy to see you. I just miss you so much when I'm at work. Yes. Oh my goodness. Did you have a fun time with daddy while mommy was at work? Yeah. Oh, you're so cute. I just love you. I just love you. I do. Oh my gosh. It looks like you missed mommy too. It looks like you missed mommy. Yeah. I am currently working on setting up Madeline's new bathtub. Um, here it is. Uh, you can see the price. I paid $54.99 for it. And this is the Summer Lil Luxuries Whirlpool Bubbling Spa and Shower. And um, yeah, it's a little ridiculous for a baby, but um, Madeline got some money for Christmas and I really was interested in buying her this bathtub because she really really loves bath time and I thought this would be kind of cool so I just put it together and I will be doing a full review of this product on my personal channel so the link will be in the description below but I thought I'd give you guys a little um, look into it so there's this little sling here it grows up with the baby so basically you know when they're newborn infant stage before they can sit up there's this little sling here for them um, and then I'll take that out and then uh, basically when they sit up this turns into a little bathtub for them so they can just sit in there and they don't have to sit in the full tub and what's really cool about this is there's two options here um, one of them is well there's a shower head I'm not sure how well you can see this so there's a shower head that comes out like that 
And then there's also um, a whirlpool and then there's a bubble setting. And so there is a whirlpool setting that basically puts jets that come out of here that swirl the bubbles or swirl the water around. And then this little track has these holes in it. So those will actually make little bubbles. And she really likes the bubbles in her bathtub. And so I thought this would be kind of cool and fun to see how she responds to that. And then this also, you can put water down in here. There's a little reservoir here for the shower head. So I am really excited to try this out. Um, one con that I have about this so far is that nowhere on the box or even online did it tell you what type of batteries you needed to make this work. I was assuming C batteries, so I bought C batteries, and I opened it up to find out that it actually requires D batteries. So, I cannot make this work, so I don't know if I'll be using this tonight or not. I will have to go out and get batteries, and I really, really wanted to do it. Um, but at the same time, I really wanted to stay home and not have to go out tonight, so we will see what happens. Alright guys, so I'm working on making my dinner. I've got some bread toasting with some cheese melting, but I wanted to show this. <laughs> now, um, this is something that we won at the Christmas party. Um, basically we ended up doing one of those white elephant things where you can like steal a gift from somebody or whatever, and so this is what we ended up getting. Um, Usually a lot more come out than it. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Yeah, I gotta be really careful with that because of the dogs. Anyway, so this is what we got. So I thought I'd show it. Um, that was a lot that came out there. It hasn't ever shot out that much before. But um, I think Danny's parents actually put this into the gift exchange. And so this is what we got. Danny's going to be really, really excited when he gets home to see that I set this up. All right, dinner is served. And this looks really messed up because I had these frozen and I just kind of ripped it apart. They weren't... Um, well, I microwaved it so it got really soft and now I, I kind of baked it up so it's crispy. But anyway, they didn't they weren't cut per already so I just kind of like ripped it open with my hand and it looks kind of weird. But anyway, there's my sandwich. So exciting, I know. I'm just sure everybody is just super excited and thrilled to see my sandwich. I'm sure that is why you came to the vlog, right? Yeah, right. Well, Rocky wants some. You want some, buddy? I'm sure you do. Can you show everybody your new trick? So Rocky um, was our rescue. A lot of you watched him learn how to shake. Can you shake? Give me your paw. There you go. Good boy. But now, yesterday he learned how to lay down. Can you lay down? Here, lay down. Lay down. <laughs> well, okay. There you go. That was kind of... We were teaching him how to roll over. Can you roll over? Can you roll over? Oh, almost. He's not good at showing his belly, so... Lay down. Can you roll over? Can you roll over? Roll over the whole way. Ready? Woo, good boy. We're working on it. Can you roll over? Can you roll over? Come on. What are you trying to do? You're so weird. You're such a weird puppy. You're such a weird puppy. I just gave Madeline a bath in her new bathtub, and we didn't have the um, batteries or anything still to make it work, but... Anyway, I did give her a bath, and she really, really, really enjoyed it. You were very, very happy in that bath, weren't you? So we just fed her her bottle and I have my bed sheets in the wash getting all clean and I'm going to read Madeline this book. This book was given to me by my grandparents and it was specially made just for her. Um, it's really super cute and we actually got a bonus page on the back. Um, we got a page from somebody else's book named Nora. So Nora, if you're watching this, I'm sorry. I have a page from your book um, and I don't know how to get it back to you. So anyway. All of Madeline's pages are here though, so we are going to read this book and uh, see how she responds to it. Sail away, sweet Madeline, on silver moonbeams as the goodnight parade marches into your dreams. As you drift over treetops, birds whistle a tune, and you watch your parade by the light of the moon. Owls step in together, hoot hooting in line, as they spell out Madeline in the lights on their vine. She seemed to really like that. Did you like that, sweetie? You liked that book, didn't you? She was actually paying attention and looking at the pictures, so we're gonna try another book. This is called Giraffes Can't Dance, and this was given to us by my Uncle Tony. Um, he is Madeline's godfather, so he got her a special little gift for Christmas, and we got him a special little gift as well. Um, and so we are going to read this book that he got us. He got us this book, and then to go along with it, he got us a little giraffe stuffed animal. It's so cute. And giraffes are my favorite zoo animals. So that makes me really happy. I think it's really cute. Um, I actually wanted 
Madeline's Nursery to be draft themed, but I couldn't find enough draft things that were in the same shade of yellow that I really liked. So anyway, enough of that. We are going to read this book. He was very good at standing still and munching shoots off trees. But when he tried to run around, he buckled at the knees. So I feel really bad for Madeline. Right now she's going through a teething episode, so she's chewing on one of her teethers, but she's hurting. And she goes through a couple episodes a day where she just hurts really bad. You want to chew on that? You're okay. You're okay, aren't you? You want to chew on that? Yeah, that feels good, doesn't it? Feels good to chew on that. This is the one that she seems to like chewing on the most right now. Um, I tried one of the ones that's frozen. She did not like that at all. Not even a little bit. But she seems to like this because it has these little like, these little, I don't know, what are those? Little teeth or something on there that she can, she can chew on. Um, she will actually hold this there. I don't know if she'll do it on camera or not, but she will actually hold it there and like push it further in her mouth and push it to the right spot and everything. But that seems to be working the best for her right now. Um, I'm not sure exactly what this teether is called. Oh, does that feel good? Yeah, that's better. Do you feel better now? Do you want more? Um, I will try to figure out what this teether is actually called and uh, put a Put a link down below if I can find it online or anything. This was given to me as a gift at my baby shower. But she really, really likes this, so I would definitely suggest it if you have a teething baby. Madeline, I think, is kind of over her little teething episode she had, but she was getting a little kicky, and she's still a little fussy, but not because of the teeth, I don't think so. Um, I have her on her play mat, trying to just wear her out a little bit. I'd like for her to take a little bit of a nap if I can get her to, so I can take a shower and everything, but... We will see if that actually happens, but for right now I'm just going to let her kick around and do her thing and hopefully she will get a little worn out and take a shower. I'm not comfortable leaving her here while I take a shower and I'm not comfortable bringing her into the bathroom with me either just because I would take a really, really hot shower and I don't want the hot water or the steam to affect her so I prefer not to take her in there. I know a lot of people tell me to put her on her little bounce seat and take her in with me, but I'm just not comfortable doing that. So. I have to wear her out a little bit and get her to go to sleep. What do you think? You ready to go to bed yet? Do you want to go to bed yet? Is it bedtime? No? Not quite? Okay. Madeline is finally sleeping. She was up for a while because of her teeth and everything, but um, she finally drank another, it looks like two and a half-ish ounces. Um, she had had six ounces earlier and then gone like about an hour and a half and then she just drank two and a half more and uh, she fell asleep while she was drinking that so that is really good I'm glad that she is no longer screaming from her teething or anything like that so nobody likes to see their baby in pain and she definitely was not uh, very happy she wasn't like really really bad but I could tell that it was really bothering her and she wasn't really comfortable no matter what she was doing like if she was laying down or sitting up or being hugged she just wasn't comfortable and you could tell that it was bothering her so I am definitely glad that she's laying down and sleeping now and hopefully she will have a decent night tonight but for now I am going to go get my bed sheets because I need to put my bed sheet back on here and I'm going to take a shower and go to bed so I will see everybody tomorrow. Don't forget to like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel. Find us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we will see you tomorrow. Bye.